came up on my year this last December. So 2022 was my, or 2023 was my year now that I hit. So I've, I'm a baby on the board, but I've been on it for a year. And I've always been passionate about serving my community. I love education. I love the trajectory it can take almost anyone. And I feel that I've had this really great platform in my career to better serve the community in that way. So I feel like I can make these connections happen and say, hey, this student is doing this project, go talk to them. And so I just got excited to serve because like, I just really genuinely love to help. The most rewarding experience has been the students, has been the community, has been the staff, has been faculty, has been really everyone. They've been welcoming. I came here to Southwest and watching Southwest grow and change over time and actually learn now how the system works and how the conversations are really always centered around how do we benefit the students and you know what what direction are we going with that as a school board member elected official in general you have to have so much understanding you have to have a lot of patience you have to be willing to learn everything because so many laws come out and you're going when did they all decide this and who tells you this? And really, you're fortunate to have a great team, a great district office, a great staff in general that just tells you all this stuff and can show you and point it out. But I think it really has to take a lot of humility. You have to be able to say, I don't know, and you're okay with that. It takes a lot of like positivity. You have to stay positive in, in the work that you do because I think so often um, a lot of issues arise and concerns and as uh, they are and they're valid. And I think often we get stuck in that almost negative, what are we going to do space? But you have to maintain that positive mindset. And I think when you surround yourself with, you know, positive staff, you have a great board, you have a great superintendent, just a good staff in general and community that supports you. It feels like it's easier than it, it feels like it's just a breeze, you know? And I want to thank the community, the students, the staff, my former teachers and faculty who have really encouraged and helped me along this way. Thank you.